Yes, and both these players showing a lot of patience. Both just had the one chance. And that's a good shot from Ronnie. Played that with a lot of right on side. May have been a little unfortunate, however. Just pushed a red over the right corner. One. Ball. He's a bit of luck, I think, as to where the cue ball finishes, because I think he'll hit into a red. Six. Six. John Higgins. Yeah, someone's tempted into going for that, and that could be a big mistake. The Reds are One. very nicely situated now at the top end of the table. Seven. Eight. Fifteen. And Ronnie O'Sullivan visibly taking a shade longer on his shot than normal, and I think it's a measure of the respect he's got for John Higgins. And uh, I think when Ronnie does do this, he's certainly not slow, but he's still one of the fastest in the game. But uh, I think it makes him that much stronger. Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. Thirty-six. And certainly the last time these two players met in met in the Welsh 42. Open in Newport. Um, Ronnie was well ahead and his opponent John Higgins cleared up to win including the final frame so that will be in his memory. to get behind the yellow. One. And I think it was a needless risk that this young man's liable to take advantage of. John Higgins. Well, it was a bad shot. He said he certainly should have made sure the red wasn't going to kiss the brown. Confidence and knew he was going to split those. One. But that previous shot from Ronnie didn't do himself a lot of harm by putting the brown against that side cushion. Johnny's going to need that to go on and win the frame at one visit. Eight.
fighting. Sixteen. Well, he certainly left himself the angle to move the brown. Rest in the extension. Nineteen. Safety shot. And, uh, he avoided it well. Really does know, know his way round the table with these safety shots. Yes, and Ronnie having to swerve this to hit the brown. And that looks as though it's over the centre, so this is a great chance for John. Although the blue's not going to be a the normal formality of its spot to have to go into one of the corners. Four. So, just the pink required. Yeah. And certainly, Ronnie O'Sullivan, if he loses this frame, We'll remember that shot on the uh, third last red. Safely in. So this young Scotsman stays cool and takes what? A 25 minute opening frame. 1 0 to John Higgins. Sixteen, Ronnie O'Sullivan. So that was a good chance that Ronnie didn't take full advantage of. Yes, he played it well. In fact, he played it in such a way he couldn't leave a lot, and he missed it. Seventeen. Twenty-five. And there's still a couple of reds just behind the pink that will go to the left corner pocket after the black. Forty-eight. Forty-eight. John Higgins. Yes, John shaking his head. He got, uh, as you see here, the cue ball jumped a little, and John's gesture showed what he thought of it. One. Bad time to get a kick. 
in sight of winning this second frame. Five. Six. And that's a good shot from Ronnie. Sixteen. Seventeen. Yeah. Twenty-four. Yes, and you would think now the only saviour for John would be this blue near the left-hand side cushion, which Ron is going to require. 27. 29. Just had a quick look, Ronnie O'Sullivan, to see if there was an angle to get that blow off that uh, might save John's bacon. 32. 32. Hasn't got it. Thirty-six. Well, six inches shot of being near perfect. Wonderful shot to sort out. One good shot on the blue, though, required now. Forty-one. Sullivan showing his mettle now. Brilliant 47 clearance to level the match at one frame apiece. Nine. One. In an awkward position for John here, however. One. And uh, I think that says something there, taking the long pot on. The, uh, Got the cue ball back down the table, but look where the red finished. That doesn't half make a difference at this One. game. A let off. Thank you. <laughs> a little bit of friendly banter from the crowd. One shouts Ronnie, the other shouts John. The referee shouts quiet. One. One.
good shot in the circumstances. Yes. So he wasn't a gimme from tight against the side cushion. 32. Well, tried to use power and a lot of top on the white to Yellow run ball. through the reds for the blank, but didn't get enough top on the white. Foul. 33. And given Ron O'Sullivan. Foul's sh four. Sh shot John and a Higgins. free ball. Free ball. But I'm quite sure John Touching will ball. have Ronnie play again from where it is. So, from all those options, Higgins puts O'Sullivan in again. Foul four, and a miss, John Higgins. We should have the angle this time, however. That looks better. And that's just about perfect. Four. Left centre, bring the pink into play. Five. Eleven. No, you remove the red from the black spot with this previous shot. You can no drop on the black after this red. Eighteen. Thirty-two. Well, the way he's played that, it appears he's going to go into the four reds now. Overcut it. Thirty-nine. John Higgins. I thought he was just a shade unlucky going into the bunch of four. He could have come on something easier. One. is going to take a good shot to get on a red here. 
Almost uh, playing for one into the centre. Ten. and quite rightly playing the snooker behind the blank not risking the pot I think that's going to feature Ronnie's game throughout this match his, his safe display has been much better than I've ever seen it yes and but for one frame he's resisted the temptation to go for just one shot too many Sullivan missed to the middle wasn't all that easy. Didn't really get hold of the white. He was trying to hold it much nearer the black. Positional shot for yellow. And now Sullivan should be five up with six to play. <coughs> yes, and without any pressure, you'd certainly fancy Ronnie from this position. Nine. Even with the pressure now. seen four brisk frames this evening. <laughs> O'Sullivan has won three of them and is now within a frame of the Masters title with a lead of 8-3. of a push shot and they are close that's probably why he's deciding not to play it using the rest for one in the left corner Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. Quiet, please. Thank you. So the 
the difference. 45. Seven. So, as you see there, 51 on the table, just this red. Eight. Yes, I think both these players are, are 19 years of age, but I think really Ronnie is much more experienced in some ways than John. And that surely is enough. Yes. John Higgins finally concedes. He's had a magnificent seven days at the Wembley Conference Centre, but it's Ronnie O'Sullivan playing to his best snooker of the week to take the Benson Hedges Masters title for 1995. Nine frames to three.